Hello everybody and welcome to the channel. Now, for sale is my Lexmoto ZSB 125. So I'll show you around the bike and, uh, and have, a, you know, have a chat with you. So the bike, I'd say, is in really mint condition. It's in really nice condition. Of course, I've only been out on the bike and got wet once when I went to Matlock Bath. I've washed the bike, cleaned it all off. I normally put silicon spray on, but I haven't, so you can see it as it is. Um, so, why well, I'm selling it, I want more power. Now, I bought the 125 because I hadn't ridden for seven years and had two bad motorbike accidents, and I wanted to make sure that I was going to be okay on a bike before I spent a lot of money on a bike. So, I bought this one. Now, I'm looking at test riding a Royal Enfield Meteor, which is a bit more money, and... Uh, so this one's got to go to make room for that because I think that once I've got the Royal Enfield Meteor I'm already thinking that I'm going to buy one um, I won't be riding this and like I say it's all very clean very very clean it's not done many miles at all now years ago I used to have two bikes but that's because I was uh, using bikes to get to work and back and I rode in all weathers. Now this is this now is just for fun. So the top box will come with the bike and it also comes with two keys, two keys for the ignition and two keys for the top box as well. Top box is second hand. It's got a proper hinge on the top box with a metal pin through there you can see. To remove the top box, you press down on this button and pull up on the case, you know, so you press that and then pull up that. But I just leave it on. It come really handy. Obviously, when if I do, I say when, and if I do get the Royal Enfield Meteor, I don't think I'll put a top box on it. I might put a saddle bag on it. Something that looks a bit more of the part. I'd say it's a 20 plate, so it's just over a year old. Turn the bike on. So on here you've got obviously your mileage, rev counter, or odometer, I think they, that's how they pronounce it. And you can see it's done 1,291 miles. The tank's full. It's not in gear. If I put it into gear, I need to spin the wheel a bit. To... There we go. You can see the number one. So if I just click that back up, the green lights come on for neutral. Starts up first time, no problem, from cold. Plus that engine is stone cold. I've literally just pushed it out the garage, took the lock off and pushed it out the garage. I'll be keeping the disc lock that I bought for this bike to use on my next bike. So what you're getting is what you see here. You get the bike in good condition with low mileage uh, and the top box and the two sets of keys. Uh, one there it's got this bit of plastic on it that's how it came with the tape on and and that's the place that I bought it from so yeah I've enjoyed it I do enjoy riding it but I do plan on doing some bigger trips and now I could do it on this and it'd be a bit of a challenge once I've loaded it up because I was planning on putting a tent here possibly side bags things like that but then I thought, well, I'll go for the Royal Enfield and uh, and and use that instead. So it's got a little bit more power. Well, almost twice the power. It will come with the original handlebars as well. Um, it's up to you to fit them if you want to change them. I prefer this and this is how it's coming. I'm not going to be trying to unbolt it and doing things like that because when I put this on, I did thread lock it because I didn't want this coming loose. Rubber 
bikes probably on, on the wheel look you know that they don't done much mileage there was a few more on it when I bought it but of course as I've got my confidence back I've leaned the bike over a bit more you can see on the front wheel they were they were quite further in so the guy who obviously had it before me must have been pretty nervous um, on the bike so yeah you see the red paint from where they made the tire So I'm asking uh, £1,400 or nearest offer for the bike. So I've got the top box and everything. Um, but basically I want to get back what I paid for the bike and the handlebars and I'm happy. I'm not going to lose it on the bike because the bikes are now £2,000 brand new. It's only a year old, it's in mint condition. It's got all the paperwork that I got with it and, uh, and that's it. So thanks for watching.